hello. Welcome once again to Seven Things Plays. I'm your good friend Bradley, and today we are playing Valheim. Our good friend Kevin is getting a much needed rest. Some things have happened between the last episode and this one, and I'm going to show them to you now. You will notice that Kevin now has a level four Lox Cape, so his armor rating is at 100, which I think is the best you can get in the game, so that's fantastic. I've also made some more very good food. We were hunting a lot of lox, a lot, a lot, a lot of lox. And so we now have lox meat pie. We have some fish wraps. We have some serpent stew. I cooked my serpent meat and turned it into stew. So with serpent stew, this and the blood pudding. Yeah, I think that's like as good as you can do. Eh, fish wraps has more stamina than the serpent stew, but 80 and 80 and 2400 seconds. Not bad. So we have some amazing food that we can use when we actually are ready to do the next boss. And speaking of the next boss, let's go out here. Because we have found some things, and there's some pretty interesting things. I have a brand new portal here that's kind of in the middle of everything. I don't love that. We're going to have to get rid of some of these other portals that we don't need. But we have spare number two. If we jump in here... Ba -ba -ba -da -ba -ba -ba. <coughs> Hey, Kevin has created another little outpost. You can see that we have actually encircled some uh, cloud berries here. So I was looking for, before we do the whole tour here, look, there's a roof, there's a little lookout post up above, there's a workbench, there is a chest that is empty, and there is a portal. I hear a fueling out here. Oh, one other thing that happened is that there was a new event called, I think some, something about the horde, the horde is attacking. And it was fueling and fueling berserkers, a whole load of Yodamen and fueling shaman that attacked me. It was insane. I don't want that to ever happen again. But let's look at the map. Oh, okay. So we have our normal base. I was looking for any sort of sign of a vague vizier to find out where the next boss is for the fuelings. I was running around all over here, didn't find anything at all. So then I thought, Motors Island, which is over here. Eh. We've been here, we noticed that there were a lot of plains areas around here. And so I thought maybe I will take a boat, which I did, do, 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 landed here and decided to start looking around this area. Well, I found this area that I'm at now. And if you look over here, there is another Stonehenge. And if you look closely, we're gonna get up here onto our little lookout tower. It would appear, in addition to two giant uh, fueling berserker over there. Let's get on the roof. Look at that. That's a vague vizier right where my crosshair is. So I'm pretty sure that that's the vague vizier. But then I also noticed that over there. And I'm pretty sure that's where the boss is. So we just stumbled into this. I marked it here on the map. We're going to go look at this vague vizier. I built this whole camp thinking I want to I want to have a nice foothold here. We're going to go. We'll check the vague vizier out. We'll clean out these fueling berserkers. But then I found that over there. Oh, did it again. It's always going to happen. Every single time. There we go. So it looks like we may have already located the boss. I'm wondering if I hit this vague vizier, is it going to automatically go to that one? <clears throat> or are there several of these boss altars and it's going to pick one at random? I really hope it's that one because then we'll be right there to the next boss. Uh, but we need to take out these two fueling berserkers. I want to make sure there aren't any other little fueling around. I thought I heard some laughing here. And I don't want to run into them. There are several Desquitos around too, so we need to be kind of careful here. If we're going to fight the berserkers, let's see what Kevin can do with the old Draugr bow. I think I got him. You got him, Kevin. Oh, he's moving fast. He's going to break my wall down immediately. Staggered him. Hit him again. Ooh, nice, Kevin. Oh, we're just kicking the schniz out of this guy. Got him again. Oh, this is great. This is fantastic. Hit him again, Kevin. He's frozen. He doesn't know what... Oh, he was poisoned. Okay, he's gone. Good job, Kevin. I've been going through obsidian arrows like a mofo, too. Where is that normal fueling? We're going to venture out here at some point. I want to tag this other berserker. Got him. Got him again. 
Okay, where's he going? Oh, you missed, Kevin. You need to lead your target a little bit, buddy. He doesn't even know what's hitting him, I don't think. That's why he's just frozen. He can't figure it out. Let's get him right in the face. Yes! Yes, Kevin! This is going much better than I thought it was going to. I thought they would come up and they would start breaking down my walls. But that is not the case. We're going through a lot of arrows. Definitely going through a lot of arrows. Is he going to die? He's poisoned. Come back here. Little creep. They're actually giant creep. Come here. <sighs> Damn it, quit moving. <sighs> he's, he's taking shelter amongst the standing stones. I don't know if I could hit him. Oh, oh, that that's like a miles long shot. It's American sniper. Okay, so we still have 73 arrows left. That's cool. Let's run down and take a look at this. Let's arm ourselves actually this way in case there are any of the little cannon fodder fueling little Yodaman running around. This is exciting. Okay, here we go. Nice. Ooh, a Berserker trophy. That's got to be huge. Put that up on Kevin's mantelpiece. Any other fueling around? Oh, look at this. <gasps> oh. All right. Ancient seed. Stuff we don't really need. I don't really have any use for jewels anymore. Okay, where's the body of the one that we killed? He's over here. Hello? Where is he? Oh, there it is. Look at that shot. That's crazy. From all the way over there, Kevin slayed him with his massive bow. All right. Are we ready to hit the Vague Vizier? Yagluth. Yagluth is the next boss. Yes! Yes! That's where it is. That is freaking fantastic. Okay, now we know. So now we need to run up there and see what's going on. I don't know what time of day is it. I don't know that we have time to make it all the way up there. I'm going to arm myself with my bow. We're going to see if we can get close. To watch out for Yodaman. Watch out for... Oh, Deskitos. One right there. God, Kevin is a freaking amazing bowman now. That's ridiculous. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Welcome. Ah. Bam. Bam. Laughing while you die, you little creep. All right, he's dead. Where is our needle? I can't find the needle from the Deskito we killed. Yeah. It's all right. I'd like to make some more needle arrows, maybe for the next boss. I don't know exactly what the next boss is going to be like. Yagluth. I'm assuming maybe it's going to be some sort of giant fueling creature. Everything else, you know, we had drakes in the mountain biome, and so we had a giant dragon as the boss there in the swamp. We had skeletons, so we had a huge mass of skeletons. In the forest, we had all the gray dwarfs, so we had kind of a tree-ish creature. And in the woods, we have, our, or in the plains, we had all the deer, which aren't really enemies, but we had the giant deer creature, so I'm assuming we're going to have some kind of fueling sort thing. Wow, this is crazy. Look at this. This is wild, man. Okay. What do we need here? Oh, wow. Five pieces. Offering bowl. Attach item. Incomplete offering. So what, is, what, does, it have? what does it have here? <gasps> and his dying soul was split and shared among all his kin. Interesting. Uh, can I please do my inventory now? Thank you. Dying soul was split and shared amongst all his kin. So we need five pieces of something. What have we found? We're going to have to run back home and check out what we've got in some of our chests, some of the totems and trophies that we've gotten. I've had fueling trophies, but that doesn't seem like that would be it. Like just the severed heads of fuelings. Hmm. Hmm. This is exciting, though, because I thought it was going to take me forever to find the boss, and I was really not looking forward to just fruitlessly searching all around every plains biome that I could find. And to come across this uh, 
Stonehenge area, and then that, which you can't see because of the mist. Oh, there it is. It was very lucky. Very lucky indeed. This is a huge area of plains, too. And if indeed we are fighting a Yagluth, and it is indeed a giant fueling, it seems like the fuelings don't have any natural weaknesses. So I'm not sure exactly what kind of weapon we should bring into the battle, if it's going to be a melee-type fight or more of a ranged fight. Kevin's going to have to figure all this out. But here we are. We're going to have to divest ourselves of the black metal that we just gathered and everything else we can bring with us. Let's go and see what we've got in some of our chests. <laughs> I should also bring some materials to make a portal to where the fueling is. I think, let's see, I had spare. Do, do, do. Uh, that spawn, where is that? Isle base, evil troll, planes, spare. So this is the one that took us to where we fought motor. So we don't really need this anymore, I don't think. So what I think I'm going to do is break this baby up over here. This one. Bam. And we'll rebuild that where Yagluth is located. So we'll have to run down the mountain, obviously, which is no big deal. Let's go. All right, we're almost there. Being on the mountain kind of reminds me of our good friend, Doug, our former good friend, Doug. <sighs> Maybe we should give Doug another chance. I don't know. The Lock's cloak is nice, but eh, it doesn't quite have the flair that Doug used to have. We'll see. We'll see about that. Okay, so now we're heading back. We have the makings of another portal for the uh, called Spare. We'll put that where Yagluth is. But before we do that, let's try to figure out exactly what we're going to need to summon the beast. We have trophies here. Um, oh, channels the ancient power of Yagluth. I don't know if I ever actually read that. Oh no, so we need four more fueling totems. Oh, I've got one. Where did I get that? So we need three more fueling totems. All right, uh, I'm gonna have to think about where we can find those. I think I found them in fueling villages before, but the last couple, oops, the last couple fueling villages I've been in have not had any. If I can remember, what am I doing? Huh. Yeah, this might be kind of tough, actually. We're going to have to look into this. Um, yeah, let me put my stuff away. Maybe we'll travel back to our little base on the plains. We'll set up our portal at Yagluth, and then we'll think about where we can actually get more materials or more fueling totems. This could be tough. All right, here we are. We've got some wood. We've got materials to make a portal. Let's go over to where Yagluth is hanging out. And we'll set something up. Hopefully, we're not going to be attacked. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah. There we go. Kevin is so good with the bow now. That's quite nice. We'll set something up and hopefully in a somewhat kind of safe area. I don't know how far we should do it from this evil beast. I don't know how, I don't know, I don't know what we're going to be facing. So I don't know how extensive the damage to the environment may be. Is it going to be something that's going to run and try to destroy our portal? We'll have to figure this out. I mean, we're already pretty damn close with the portal over there. So it's not a huge deal. There's another Desquito. <clears throat> nice, man. Kevin is freaking amazing. A lot of cloudberries around here, too. All right, so... Maybe this would be an okay place. Let's grab this. Let's level some terrain. It seems kind of close, maybe. But maybe that's fine. We'll just do a little stockade. Just to keep it sort of safe from all the evil beasties that live around here. Let's go with crafting. That goes there. Let's go with building. That goes there. That goes there. Come on. 
quick and dirty. Some place that Kevin can run into and quickly make his escape if he needs to. I don't know if we're going to have enough wood for all this, actually. Okay, let's do a gate. Oh, we'll put that right there. And then we'll just shove this in here. And stop it. Put that there. Like so. And this one we'll just kind of cram in there like that. Okay, I think we're good. Might put a chest just in case. Like so. And actually, we're going to knock this one down. We're going to make a new one. Ratch over here. Right there. And then we put up our portal. And it will say... Uh, let's put it over here. Oh, oh, oh. Saving. Saving. Constarn it. This way. Right like that. Okay. This one we will name Spare. Bam. Hey, it's connected. Okay, so it's raining. Obviously, we're not going to summon Yagluth right now, and we can't summon Yagluth right now, but I do want to go and run and grab one of those totems and see what happens if I put it on the pedestal. I'm pretty sure that's what it is. I mean, it mentions Yagluth by name, so we shall see. Bam. Excellent. Okay, Yagluth Totem. We have two of them. Get rid of this. We may have to do the kind of thing where if we do get all the totems we need and we summon Yagluth, maybe we'll do a preliminary summon just to see what kind of beast he is. Uh, there we go. And then we can plan what kind of weapons we're going to need, what kind of ammo. <sighs> I think maybe I should make some needle arrows. I have quite a few needles now. Here we go. Stop rain, please. I'm glad there aren't any berserkers around here. Okay. Attach item. <gasps> That's right. It was right. Okay, can I grab these again? Yeah, I'm going to grab these just in case. So we need three more fueling totems. There were definitely some, some things around... Uh, some more fueling villages. Maybe if we just kind of... Oh! I thought something was attacking me. Maybe if we just go around the coast. Or what's closer? I mean, we've got our camp here. Mm. Yeah. I don't know. I think... Maybe we'll go in this direction. We'll see if we can find any fueling villages. I don't have amazing food going right now, though, so I'm a little worried about getting too crazy. I guess we could always just run in and see if there's a village and then see if they have any totems <clears throat> and not necessarily fight anybody. Let's just take a look. The fact that it's raining right now means that my stamina is schniz. So that's not fantastic. We could always use Ekthir's power, but I don't have Ekthir's power uh, available at the moment. I'd have to go change it out. Let's just take a look around. Watch out for Deskitos. Might as well arm ourselves. So there's still some work to do. Oh, two right there. I'm not seeing any villages around here. Maybe the best thing to do would be to go by boat. I think that's what I'm going to do. I think I'm going to grab a boat. We're going to head back and we will just s scour the coastline. Hopefully we'll get a nice clear day so we don't have to worry about the rain. I'll load myself up on some good food and then we'll try to do some raids and find some totems. All right, gang. Kevin is well rested. Kevin is going to go get a very nice meal from out of his chest over here. Hopefully the rain is going to stop completely. I have activated Ekthir's power. Uh, yeah, let's do this. So we could do Serpent Stew. We could do this. Oh, yeah, look at that. Look at that. That's freaking crazy. And then we also have a boat in our inventory. Look at that. <laughs> That's insane. 
I shouldn't waste that. You know, I shouldn't use it very often. But oh, wait a minute. This is spare two. We want to go. I guess we could do spare two. We'll see where we could go. Maybe I'll go up onto the little watchtower and see if there are any villages around. Um, we don't want to waste the food. We want to use it for when we're actually fighting a boss. But my lord, that's a lot of uh, uh, energy. It's quite nice. A lot of hit points. And there's a damn mist. So I can't really see anything. Is that a village? Is that a place I've already been? I think I may have already... Oh, no. It doesn't look like it. Yeah, let's run to this coast, because I definitely noticed things when we were going around trying to find motor originally. There's a tower here. There's other things along the side. So I think we'll head to the coast, and then we'll take a right, and we'll see what we can find. My God, look at me. Look at the power. Uh, I guess I'll just jump down. Ow! Nope, he's fine. All right, we'll arm ourselves with the bow first, just in case. Look out for Desquitos. There's one right there. Oh, you missed it, Kevin. Your streak is ended. That must be way further than I thought. Oh! <laughs> yeah! There we go. Good job, Kevin. Should probably grab that needle if I'm going to be making arrows out of them. Look at that, 259. Frickin' crazy. Okay, no village here that I can see. Let's continue along the coast. I'm a little worried about getting really far from our portals. Uh, but we'll see what happens. We need three more totems, and I've only found two throughout the entire time I've been playing, so I'm... Ugh. I hope it's not going to take forever to find these things. Now look at this. Are we going to... Are we going to find anything here? Yeah, I'm going to leave that one alone. <laughs> Don't get wet, Kevin. I didn't know you liked to get wet. There's Motors Mountain. I'm assuming we're going to run into just kind of stray Yodaman as we go. Oh, look, here we go. Here's a village right here. We haven't been there. This could be it. Okay, I'm going to arm myself or disarm myself. We're going to get Ekthir's power and we're going to run in and see what we can find. Okay, we've already got a Berserker. We've got fueling. Is that a totem? Is that a freaking totem? Grab it. Got it. Oh, look at that. Okay, there's shaman. There's everybody everywhere. <laughs> That's dangerous. That's very dangerous, and I don't know how many are going to be chasing after us. We're going to be grabbing desquitos as we go, too. This might not be the best plan in the world. Okay. They're still coming. Do they have a tether? Ow! There's a desquito. They're not that big of a deal nowadays, though. Okay, we're going to have to have some stamina to get across this water. How big of a tether do these fueling have? Desquito. I would like to stop and kill the Desquito, but I know if I stop to try to get my bow out, these fueling are going to be all over Kevin. Here it comes. I can take some hits. Kev boy can take the hits. He's got very good armor. Okay, where are these fueling? Where are these fueling? Okay, okay, okay. Let's take care of the Desquito. Fueling. There's still at least one coming. Come here, Desquito. Gotcha. Looks out. Did not notice you. I gotta take these out before the fueling get here. That was very dangerous, Kevin. Okay, they keep smacking me. I think we're okay. I think the fueling went home. We're going to continue on. Give these guys a wide berth. All right, so we need two more trophies. We are wet at the moment, which is not fantastic. Man, there's so many of these damn cloudberries that I could be grabbing right now, but I have not been. Okay, good. Good eye, Kevin. Very good eye. Where is that damn thing? There it is. Okay, we need another village. We need another frickin' village. 
So it looks like the totems are always just kind of hanging up. Ah. Eh. On a post in the middle of the village. So if they have one, we should see it. I don't know if they'd be in chess. I don't think I found any in chess. I'm not totally sure about that. I should have been paying more attention to that, but I didn't realize that they would be important. Okay, th is this the tower that I saw? Uh-oh, one star. One star fueling. Nope, Kevin, I wanted this. Do this. No, he's got a javelin. Okay, he's almost gone, though. Okay, good, 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 good. Good, good, good. So, we have a giant tower. I am no longer wet. We have some health potions. We have a bunch of locks over there. Would there be a thing in the tower? I don't know. We took out that doofus. There's a fueling right there. He's coming. Is the locks coming too? God damn it. No, 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 no. Ow, another Desquito. This is not good. The locks is huge. Ah, uh, there's a fueling. Ah, uh, there's a fueling. Oh, schniz. Okay, they're all coming. Run. Nope, 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 nope. Take that out. <sighs> frickin' out. Frickin', frickin' chicken. Okay, okay. We're gonna have to just face them. Do your shield. Okay, we survived that fairly well. Okay, he's gone. Desquito. Come on. Come on. You creep. Ah, damn it. God, I hate these things. They're so annoying. I see another little construction over there. That might be more fuelings. Come on. Okay, I noticed another one. Okay, so there's that over there. We have the tower we could explore now. We still have over 200 hit points. I think we're okay. Let's take a look. Okay, I still hear them. Still several fueling. Is that a berserker at the top? That's impossible. He can't fit in there. Eh. Oh, wow. I was not expecting that. Okay. It's filled with them. It's filled with the little creeps. <laughs> what are they doing? This is dangerous, Kevin. Oh, Lord. Hello, gang. Is it... Is it even remotely possible... <laughs> What's going on with these guys? that there is a totem up here. I guess these guys can't get down. Can I shoot them from down below? Maybe. Show yourself. That's not going to work. That's not going to work. That's not going to work. How do I... Sh it's not going where I aim it. Not getting them. Damn it. Okay. That's not going to work. Let's do this. Hello. You can't hit me. Okay, this is not good. Okay, I knocked this guy down. That's good. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, he's gone, he's gone, he's gone. Let's quickly not do that. Let's quickly do that. Okay, we've got three totems. I knocked down the stairs. That's kind of annoying. I don't even know if there are other totems up here. Oh, Lord. Somebody just fell down on top of me. Oh, Lord. Okay, let's, let's leave for now. This is crazy. Maybe one of them will chase me out. I don't like fighting them in those confines. That's crazy. Okay, here we go. 
I don't like the knockback on this thing because I knock him out of my range. Is there a totem in this in this tower? Oh, this is annoying. Come on, Kebbo. Get up. Can I shoot these these men? These Yota men? Nope. I can't hit anything. There we go. Just gotta lead him a little bit. Come here, Yodaman. Okay, good. We got rid of the one star. This is good, Kevin. Don't break this frickin' ladder. Nice. Okay, I can take him out now. Come here, you little creep. <clears throat> okay. The tower is ours. Oh, no, it's not. It's almost ours. I can't swing at him right now without breaking the ladders, so I need to be careful of that. He is dead. Is somebody hitting me? There's no totem in here. Ugh, okay, that was a huge waste of time. Alright, well, we have attacked the tower. There are some other things near, hopefully. I thought for sure that I saw more villages as we were going around this coastline. So we will check that out. We're going to be hitting Swamp soon, though. But we'll check out this bit of coast. Hopefully we'll find a couple more totems. But until next time, until we meet again, I'll be a good friend. And I'll see you later. Kevin is the king of the plains. He has conquered the plains.